Hey guys, today I'm going to be giving you a quick little video on how to unbrick any 3DS system. So if you remember, last year I bricked one of my 3DSs. It was a blue screen, there was no safe mode, no ARM9 loader hacks, no nothing. So it seemed all hope was lost besides a hard mod at this point. Until NTR Boot got released, that is. So this allows us to take advantage of a boot exploit so we can load stuff before the NAND is even accessed, and then unbrick it like that. So to do it, you need a compatible DS flashcard. There's a list on screen now. This may get updated in the future, so make sure to check the links in the video description to see if it got updated or not. So now what I'm going to be doing in this video is just a few steps from 3ds.guide because it doesn't make it specific to tell you what to do if your console is bricked like mine is. So you need to complete the initial setup steps like flash the needed firmware onto your DS flash card and all the other stuff that it tells you to do. I'm going to be continuing at this exact step on screen now, so you need to do all of the setup steps and everything before that. So yeah, let's get started. You want to download this folder that I'll have linked in the video description and copy all of the files to your 3DS's SD card, like this. Once you've got them all copied, eject your SD card and put it back into your bricked console. Now, as you can see, my console is bricked and won't turn on at all. To fix this, you'll need to get a magnet to activate sleep mode. I'm just using these ones that you throw into the air and then they make crackling noises as they touch. So get the magnet positioned onto your console so that it would activate sleep mode if your console worked properly. A good spot is on or around the B button, but mine seems to activate only by putting it on the side of it. Once you've got the magnet positioned, you can test it by just pressing the power button, and your console should not turn onto the blue screen or black screen or whatever it is, if it is positioned properly. So once you've got that magnet positioned, you kinda need to get your hands loose. You need to hold down the select, start, X, and power buttons all at the same time. Once you see the blue light turn on on the bottom of your console, take away the magnet and you can let go of the buttons and you should be booted into safe B9S installer. From here you can press the button combo that it says to on screen and then it should install SIG hacks. Press the A button once it's done and then it'll bring you back to the same menu asking you to do the same thing. You don't need to do this of course, so just hold down the power button until your console turns off completely. At that point you can continue on following 3ds.guide because your console is now unbricked. Once you complete it you should be able to boot up and it'll be fully functional again. So yeah, thanks for watching. Leave a like if this video helped you, comment if you need help or if you want to help anyone else out, and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. And I'll see you next time.